been dumpster diving today. We got a tiny little haul. First, we stopped at Price Cutter, and we got a few um, St. Patrick's Day envelopes. Two um, packages of the hickory smoked bacon. So that's two pounds of bacon. We got a um, bell pepper that I'm letting my ha guinea pig have, and we got a honey ham. And let's see if I see an expiration date. I do not see one on the ham. And best if used by March 16th, 2019. That was just a couple, that was yesterday, so that's not a big deal. And then we went to the bread store and we got two box of the poppets. And their expiration date or best used by date, if I can find one. It says January 3, but you know, they've closed, and I ate some out of this package, as you can see. So, as you can see, I opened this one and have been eating it, and they're just fine. And the date on it was also January 3. And then we stopped at, at uh, Sally, not Sally's, Ulta, and I found these. I'm going to use them for um, my displays. I think they'll work quite nicely for my jewelry. And then I stopped. Yeah, take that stuff and put it in the freezer. Then I stopped at, um, what do you call that place? Uh, Bed, ba uh, Bed Bath & Beyond. Kirkland Dumpster. I found this, whatever it's supposed to be. And I got a um, Santa Claus hat. I got this little thing here, and I can use it as a melting pot for the candles. And this is... Um, broken. <laughs> I saw it was completely broken when I got in the car with it. So it's probably just going to be what you consider garbage. It's going to go in the garbage. And then I got another USB cord which I needed. <laughs> so here Brian you can throw this bad boy in the garbage because the cord that we got don't go to him and he's busted. So yeah anyway that was a little haul for today. So you got price cutter, bread store, um, Bed Bath and & Beyond, and Ulta. Yeah. So, anyway, if you liked the little video, give us a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't, share us if you get a chance, and thanks for supporting the table, or, or the, sorry, the YouTube channel. Woo, the table. Ah. <sighs> Arkansas can't decide if it wants to be hot or cold. We've had nothing but cold weather and nothing but rain. Then all of a sudden it'll be 60 degrees and beautiful, and by nightfall it's raining again and cold as hell. Crazy stuff around here. I think Arkansas is bipolar. Anyway, give us a thumbs up. Love you. Take care. Bye.